and welcome back to my channel. Hope you're all having an amazing day and I hope that intro made it that little bit better. <laughs> You would not believe the amount of effort that had to go into that intro. Ron, my incredibly talented husband, created that soundtrack for me. Obviously, I did the vocals for it, which was really, really cool. Um, but he created everything from the drums to the guitar. Obviously, it's a cover of the original, um, but you'll be able to hear little differences that he sort of tweaked and added as well. So it was really, really cool. So, so fun to create. And yeah, and then I just did like little video clips to fill it in. But yeah, I loved that. And... As you can probably tell by the title and by the intro of this video, we are gonna do a full swatch session and a little mini review of the Friends Revolution Collection. This is a dream come true for me. So many of you tagged me in this collection when they sneaked it and said that it was coming soon. So thank you so much, um, but I would have seen it anyway because I'm such a huge Friends fan and if you, yeah, if you guys have been around on my channel, you guys know I love Friends, like, my phone case is Friends, my mug is Friends, like, Friends is life. I love it so, so much. Also, if any of you are interested in this phone case, it was £8.99 from funcases.com, um, I'll leave a link down below, but I've also got a discount code for them which is 10% off. So if you wanted to use the code Sammy Lee, you can actually get 10% off all of their friends' phone cases or all of their website, actually. But if you're interested in a phone case, they've got ones that say Unagi on it. They've got some, like, quotes, like Princess Consuela Banana Hammock. Like, they've got some really good phone cases on there, but I really love the collage. And then they also do it with a black background as well as the white. So, yeah, just in case guys are interested, I'll leave the phone case link down below. I'm also going to leave the collection down below for you guys, but I'm going to link it to Revolution Beauty and also Beauty Bay because I got half and half um, from both places. I went on to Revolution at like half past 11, stayed up till midnight. It launched quite early on the site actually. So when I got on there, a lot of it was already sold out. The mirror was already sold out. The lobster makeup bag was already sold out. The scrunchies were gone. So much of it was already sold out. And then someone said in the morning, go check out Beauty Bay. They've still got loads. So I went on to Beauty Bay, blah, 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 blah. I managed to get it all eventually, but I had to shop in two different places. So what I'll do is I'll link um, Revolution Beauty's friends section down below and also the Beauty Bay friends section down below um, just in case you needed bits from different places. I'll link them both down below for you guys. This is a swatching video, not necessarily a tutorial, but I will show you sort of what I've put on my face today. Um, but it's gonna be full swatches of all the eyeshadows, all the shade names. I'm gonna be doing lip swatches of all the lipsticks and all the lip glosses, and then showing you up close and personal with all the accessories. So yeah, if you do like this video guys, please don't forget to smash the thumbs up button. Also, if you like the intro, smash the thumbs up button for the effort put into that. And also subscribe down below guys. I'm currently in the middle of my advent calendar series and I'm unboxing so many beauty advent calendars on my channel so if you don't want to miss that make sure you subscribe turn on notifications and yeah without further ado let's dive into it so first up let's talk accessories let's talk makeup bags guys we've got the black friends revolution makeup bag with the rose gold zip we've also got the friends revolution pink lobster makeup bag with a lobster rose gold zip which is just hella hella cute i really really love this i think they're great and um, they hold all of the mini palettes as well you can put all those in there it holds quite a lot so there's actually loads and loads of room in there so yeah these are decent sized makeup bags super super cute i have so many makeup bags in my collection but i needed these because i am a collector of things and especially things like friends memorabilia and stuff like i'm all about collecting it so I had to get both. <laughs> they were eight pounds each, guys. And yeah, like I said, really good quality, amazing spacious makeup bags, and they're gonna be perfect for traveling. As well as displaying, I love having a makeup bag out on my desk, so really cute for that as well. Next up, we've got the mirror. Now this is absolutely amazing. It was 10 pounds. You've got the gorgeous photo frame, like door hanger that we see in Monica's apartment. Friends Revolution, it's got a nice, quite comfortable handle. It, I thought it was gonna be quite like too thick, but it's actually nice and got a nice grip on it. Obviously we've got the big, I'll show you the side of my face, hello. And um, we've got a big mirror and it's a really good quality mirror as well. Like, I don't know if that makes sense, but some mirrors are not the best quality. This is a really good quality mirror and it's also got no reflection on the back. So I can do, makeup tutorials and stuff on my YouTube channel and not have that 
backwards reflection, so I'm very, very happy about that. <laughs> we also have the scrunchies, which I am absolutely obsessed with. I've been loving doing sort of like a half up, half down sort of moment at the moment with my hair and like having the long curls and stuff down. Um, so I've been loving wearing scrunchies recently. Um, and we've got a pink one with the lobsters on. We've got a silver one with Marcel the capuchin on it. And we've also got the Friends Revolution little logo on a black scrunchie. So this was a three pack and this was six pounds. Again, I think they're really, really cute. Great if you're going to be collecting the collections because I think there are three drops in total for the Friends Revolution collection. We've just seen the first drop. This is the first drop. The second one is coming in 2020 as well. Not sure when the third one is going to come, but there are three launches for this, guys. So I cannot wait. We then had three lipstick drops. Now we had Rachel, Monica and Phoebe all symbolized as a lipstick which I thought was super super cute the packaging's amazing Phoebe's got a little cab on it Monica again's got that photo frame and then Rachel's got a picture of the central perk sofa I love the packaging I think it's so so cute I would normally throw away lipstick boxes but I'm not going to with these these are staying forever <laughs> the lipsticks were six pound each and I'm quickly just going to show you close-ups and lip swatches of the three different lipsticks I really, really love these formulas. I thought they were a gorgeous matte formula. Um, I thought they would be satin, the way that they applied, because they applied really creamy and smooth, but they actually were matte finishes, and I thought that was really, really nice. In particular, I really love the Rachel shade, um, but also the mono, oh, I did love all of them. Phoebe is definitely like a going out color for me, really quite rich and nice. Rachel was sort of like that kind of grey mauve, really telling of the 90s, which I really loved. Um, and Monica's was like a really nice nude shade that I would wear on like a daily basis. Um, so yeah, they all have really, really nice shades and they're all quite unique as well, which I thought was really nice. And then to go along with the three girls lipsticks, we have the three girls palettes. Now these are eyeshadow palettes for each of the characters, Rachel, Phoebe and Monica. And these are all a nine pan eyeshadow palettes and they were eight pounds each, which I thought was a really good price considering the effort that's gone into the packaging and all of the shade names correspond with each of the girls characters. So these are what they look like inside and yeah guys I'm just going to quickly show you um, all of these palettes, what they look like inside and all the different swatches and shade names. Now I'm actually wearing the Phoebe palette on my eyes today. Um, I took the shade Ice, this one right here, and I ran it into my crease with a fluffy blending brush. I then took the shade Buffet, which is this one here, and blended it into the ice to create a kind of mixed tone that you can see in my crease there. I then went all over the lid with the shade Triplet. It's really, really gorgeous and reflective. So that is all over my lid. Then I went in with the shade Smelly Cat, and I just popped it on the inner corner here on the inside just to lighten that a little bit. So that is what I have on my eyes today. Today. We then have the huge Friends Revolution Flawless Limitless Eyeshadow Palette. Now this is a bit messy where I've been swatching and playing around with it, but I really love the quality of these shadows guys. Um, it's in the tin 
it's in the tin packaging like quite a few of their other palettes are and we've got three highlighters down the center with the best names ugly naked guy mr heckles and estelle i've actually got ugly naked guy and mr heckles mixed together on my face today i absolutely love it super reflective super blinding highlight and actually these would be great as eyeshadows as well and then we've got all different character names here, um, all represented in different eyeshadow colours, which are absolutely phenomenal. I feel like the quality of these shadows is actually a little bit higher than your standard Revolution formula. I assumed it would be like a standard formula, but I always feel like their collaborations are always that extra bit special. Like they pull out the good formulas for these. Now this palette is £20, which is kind of expensive for Revolution, not gonna lie, but I don't regret getting it. I really had to get it. The packaging alone is absolutely stunning. And it says the one with dot dot dot, because obviously that's what all their episodes are called. The one with Smelly Cat, the one with Chandler Bing. Um, but yeah, <laughs> they all have, they're definitely, they're definitely not real episode names. But yeah, they all have that on it. So the fact that they've got like the clapper with this, I just, I really love the packaging and the fact that they've all got like the characters names in different colours is amazing as a friend fan. Like as a friend fan, I'm loving this collection, it's incredible. Um, but yeah, let me run through the swatches and the shade names for you now guys. And the last thing in the series one drop are the six lip glosses. Now these are all named after the six main characters, Ross, Joey, Chandler, Rachel, Monica, Phoebe. They all have their own lip gloss with their own little personalized sort of icons on the lids. Like these are perfect as collector's items as well as makeup items. I'm currently wearing Ross on my lips right now, which I'm absolutely obsessed with, especially with this blonde hair. Like I don't know if this would have suited me as well when I was brunette, um, but since I've become like a bit of a Barbie recently, I think it suits me really well in this hair colour. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna run through lip swatches and close-ups of the packaging now for you guys. I thought they were really good quality lip glosses, like not sticky at all. I've been loving wearing Ross, it hasn't faded, it's not on my teeth, like I really really love these lip glosses. They're super super comfortable, it doesn't feel like I've got a lip gloss on and sometimes you can really tell when you're wearing a lip gloss because it's tacky and it's blah 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 blah. But this is not sticky, it's not tacky, I just, it feels really smooth on my lips and I really really like it. And yeah that was everything in the first Friends Revolution makeup drop guys. I'm absolutely obsessed with these shades, with the pigmentation of the eyeshadows, with the collection, with the accessories, like I am just obsessed with it. Like, I love Friends. If you are a die-hard Friends fan, you are gonna love these. If you're not a huge Friends fan, I don't really know if you're gonna appreciate, like, the shade names and things as much as like a friends fan would but the makeup's still really good quality and the makeup compared to revolution standard eyeshadows i think are actually better 
actually much better. I really love the blend of these shadows. The shimmers, especially from the Phoebe um, palette that I've got now, went on with a brush, a dry brush at that. I didn't have to wet it, I didn't have to use my fingers, and sometimes with Revolution, that's one of the main things, like you've got to use your finger for the shimmers and stuff for them to really pay off. This was a dry brush, no spray, nothing needed to wet the brush, no finger needed, it went on so, so smooth and I was really, really impressed with that. For Evolution, that's not normally something that would happen if you're using their shadows, so I really, really like that. So yeah, that was my opinion, guys, and let me know what your thoughts were down below. Have you picked anything up? Are you gonna pick something up from the collection? Are you getting it for someone for Christmas who's a huge Friends fan. Let me know down in the comments guys. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you liked it. I'm going to leave the links for everything down below like I said before. Yeah, thank you so much for watching and hopefully I'll see you in my next video. Take care. Bye!